Hello everybody and welcome to Fish and Chips, and by that I mean South of Loathing. I mean, <laughs> I do not mean that at all actually. Metal Diving Helmet for Head, what do you would you wish to Shadow Overloathing. You seem down, not getting any business? Nope, I always thought it was a real good plan too. College kids always need pencils, right? But I can't set up a dang one of the things. They have this mean look on their faces too. Sort of pitying sneer like they think I'm super dumb and these must be dumb pencils that only write dumb answers or something. Well, that's no good. Looks scornly at you and rattles his mug of pencil as you. The mug has I'm with stupid printed on it and arrow pointing towards the middle. Do you have any hobo codes to share? Oh, you wouldn't want any hobo code I'd give you. It'd probably just be dumb and wrong. Probably mix up the ones that means free pie with the ones that means bottomless pit. Jeez, man. Buy a pencil. What does it do? Okay. But hold on. No, 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 no. I want to give him the other mug. Hey, maybe try this SIT mug instead. Hold on. I'm on the damn headphone cable. SIT mug, mug instead. Maybe that'll convince the student you're smart. Saying that might just work. Here, I'll swap you. Dumb coffee mug. Reduce all combatants' mysticality by your moxie once per fight. Ah, that's pretty good. Do you have any hope because to share? Why, certainly. Hell yeah. Leave. Uh, a man in, in a really slick suit described as such because it's both expensive and covered in grease is stuffing his face. He glances at you shiftily but otherwise ignores you. What's up, nerd? Hi there, is something wrong? Oh, well, I just moved here for school and the food is, well, I mean, it's fine, but this isn't like what they had back at home. Um, what's different about it? My dad worked at a barbecue sauce factory. Everything we ate was smothered in barbecue sauce. I thought I was ready for new experiences at college, but I'm so homesick. I can relate for me, it's maple syrup. Maybe I can help. Oh, really? That'd be swell. You could be some barbecue sauce somewhere on campus, right? It's 1928 after all. You carry sauce cups around with you? Well, yeah, like I said, barbecue sauce is a really important part of my identity. Well, I'll see what I can do. Uh, Floyd. Floyd Carbuncle. All right, big guy. You okay? Hi, oh, yeah, just since all the students are gone, there practically hasn't been anyone in here all day except that one guy gorging himself. Who is he? I don't know, but he's in here every day. All day, and he's always eating. Sometimes other guys in suits come in and they whisper together all shifty for a minute, and then the other guys... Leave and this guy keeps eating. It's freaking me out. What are they talking about? Look, buddy, I'm just working here part-time to pay my way through college, which in 1928 is completely feasible. I'm not going to be involved in whatever that guy's deal is. I mean, that seems pretty good. I'll take like three of those. These are all pretty good. Thanks, bud. Okay, let's go to Z Omega O. So to you student wearing a bulky go flag you down. Hoing! Um, yeah, sure. It's not the light of the guy when you open your mouth and fuse falls out. <laughs> Fair enough. Pile of garbage. So I'm told a fraternity row looks like there's another frat house over that way. By Upsilon Tau. Zeta Omega Omicron. Okay, well, let's just go. He, I mean, he'd be busting a move. He's doing a little grilling. It's safe to grill indoors like that? Sure, I mean, it's not my house or whatever. Currently got a taste I'm looking for, though. Can you do me a favor? What do you need? What do you ever fight up on tower? His burgs always come out super good. Some kind of special wood chips or something. Okay. There's nectar hanging on the knob of this door. That means you refuse to find out what that means. From the grunting and shouting, there's either a brawl or a sporting event. Possibly both. It's goblins! Oh, look at my little shadow rat! Oh my fucking god! Run, Ben! Run! You know, I've got XP to buy skills to make character more powerful. Yeah, okay. I got 200, huh? Um. Hmm. I'll buy... Moxie. And I'll buy max HP. Thank you. Flying 80s are operating still. You must be the chemical student, right? Guess so, but nope. I'm basically a hobo. I've been renting out my services on this portable still to make ends meet. That doesn't look very portable. That's much lighter than you'd expect. Ask her about hobo code. Sure, here's some booze-related glyphs. 
tell her about the hobo camp. You know, there's a big hobo camp over near Ocean City. I bet your skills will be really popular. Yeah, I heard about that. I'm saving up to buy a new hat first, sir. Seriously, don't think that. Mine, I know it's for my own self-confidence. I wouldn't expect a woman who owns her own still to have issues with self-confidence. Oh, I don't drink the stuff. You could use it to degrease industrial machinery. How much do you need for your hat? Okay, I'll cover you. Wow, you sure? Yeah, it's no problem. Thank you so much. This gold-plated door is a sign that says C. Chutney. Who is that or why they can afford a gold-plated bedroom door would live in the sump is anyone's guess. Well, not allowed in. Sloppy cooking for huge groups. I don't random foes for a total of five on fire. Interesting. I need stench armor. All right, boys. I'm going in. Flush that bad boy. Pile of toilet shards and art installation for a toilet. Wait. Ooh. Hold on. Filters. Muscle. What am I at? I'm at four. Damn. Okay, can't do that one. Squeeze it. Powerful grit. I need some sleaze armor. Elemental. Sleaze. Um... What do we got? We got two. We got three. Ooh, Shadow Tame. And give me this. Eat it. Yep. Creamy. Orb. Reach it. Shadow Bomb. 13 spooky damage to all enemies. Um, take a closer sniff. A uh, drum of vermouth. Uh, miscellaneous basement junk, a battery, and a paper clip. want any of that man i got that too good to use syndrome bad honestly okay so i need to find something that'll give me a little bit of extra strength or to level up overgrown with vines okay talk to him hey what you doing queuing it's a cute way to have our queuing here try one of these bad boys vegetable sausage like some HP by seven. Uh, what is it? Special plant-based sausage I'm working on. Is it any good? I didn't call it a good boy just now. I figured I need another, I don't know, 80 or 90 years to get it right. I see. Well, it's all the same. I guess don't mention it. Say, do you like the queue? Um, I love them more than anything. Well, have one of these queue and forks. I got like 10 of them. Once people find out you're into queue and you start getting them for every birthday in Crimbo. Miscality plus four hot damage. Thanks. Shave some chips off. Mesquite chips. I was hanging out of that weird stone f -f frat and I left my jacket at the bar. I'm freezing. Guess it's kind of an annual chin in the air. Sure, no problem. I'll go get your thing. Have us some materials. Let's get it get. Get closer. I unlocked Sprig. Rub his belly. No. Shrubber man. What's this shrubber working on? Some new strain of super aloe. Oh, interesting. Now they mention that the leaves do look like aloe vera, except they're wider. That's right. I'm trying to find the best balance between increased phytochemical production and concentration. How's it working out? Pretty well. Now that I've given up on crossbreeding with toxidomous ceratocans. Here, I have some ointment samples. Thanks. Neat. That is good. Uh, can I enter through the back? No. I got some mesquite chips, but I don't know. Oh my god, it is rock. Junk mail. Open. I don't have a letter open. I know that sounds frustrating. Okay. Go inside. Look for that guy's jacket. I got a jacket. Wait, I don't care about you. Get out of here. Five muscle to check under the cushions. That one I can do. Filters. Uh, muscle. Oh, wait, hold on. I've got this. There we go. Oh, damn, I'm going to get rid of my shadow salad, too. 120 meat. Thanks. Open it. There's more rocks. Stone fruit. Haha. -ha. 
Well, this is incredible. Not only this fraternity chisel, a whole frat house out of stone and furniture to match. They went so far as to sculpt a bunch of frat boy statues. Presumably, they saw them up here and then hauled them downstairs to fill out the space for parties. Some kind of weird stone thing. It looks a bit like one of those newfangled televisions you've read about. That's no television. That's a portal. Okay, I'll be back for you. What else she got? No, so we're going back again. Okay, it does have all three of them here. Okay, so you needed the jacket. No problem. Okay, so now we're going to go back to the other guy. Pip, 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 pip. Fucking stinky garbage land. Oh. Stinky garbage man. Alright. Give him escape wood chips. That's fantastic. Thanks, bro. Okay, I want this chair. It belongs to me now. Whew. Sit in it. Inherent stink. More stench armor. Great. Kinda sucks that I'm all the way back here again, but you know, let's try this. Loot queen, and then one of these, and then one of these, and then one of these, and then. Nope. 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 And I've lost. Okay, take me to Porkham. Okay, um, side quests. Five night crawlers, fish and chips wants me to find him some barbecue sauce. Um, gift shop maybe? You sell barbecue sauce? No. Buy soda. Never mind. I think, hey, maybe soda would have a thing. Barbecue wing, hold on. Frozen food. Is that won't let me in? Hold on, you can't be sleeping there. Um, any barbecue sauce you got here? Doesn't look like it, huh? Steam tunnel access. Okay. Didn't see this before. Spider wing maintenance, okay. Hex rock mines. Mention those hex rock quarry is prohibited except with written permission from the geology department or a very good reason. Damn. Free shoes. Sneakers. Thanks. Oh, hello there. Shop. Uh, haven't seen you in it before. Welcome to find this hash house in the whole underground restaurant scene. Underground restaurant scene? That's right. Wait, you ain't a cop, right? You gotta tell me if you are. No, I'm not a cop. Okay, copper kettle. In any case, we got no beef. Got no beef anyway. This is a fish place. Haha. -ha. Let's run the walls. Spells out the racket if you need an explainable thing. I to get you. Fish and soda. Oh my god, that seems great. I'll take like two of them. Interesting. I'll take one of each. You walk in this hidden restaurant you've discovered in the town you've never been to before today? Fine. Haha! -ha! Name badge. Pirate restaurant badge. Plus four sleaze armor. That's a lot of sleaze armor. Don't wash them, but thou must. Fine, wash them. There we go. Clean the sanitary, which will be extremely safe for the customers when you're serving them food later during your shift because you work here. Yeah? Flush that toilet. Flush that toilet. Wait, barbecue sauce? I need some barbecue sauce. Uh, all right, then I'm just gonna let you do your thing. I'm not gonna read all that. <laughs> um, Anarchist hardware and a bunch of other crap. Combination lock, hot flies buzzing around a vent. Hey, nerd. Hi there, I'm Rufus. How'd you find this place? I was just kind of poking around in the steam tunnels, exploring. Oh, yeah, it's a popular pastime around here. The kids call it hacking. I guess I should have anticipated when I set up the secret lab. Why do you have a secret lab? Was the department out of regular labs? I'm not actually supposed to be here at all. I used to teach here, but they let me go. What happened? Did they fire you using the forbidden math? Not here. SIT is the last place we would fire you for that. I was joking. 
They fired me because I didn't make tenure. I was too busy trying to find out what happened to my missing brother. It's probably just as well. I didn't think I was cut out for being a professor. Anyway, Department Politics are maximally bogus, as the students would say. Said how set up this hidden lab to continue to search for your brother. Okay, and where is he? He left home when he was 14 and headed north. Well, we called it west back then. He spearheaded the expedition that pushed the Transcontinental Railroad all the way to Frisk. Oh my god, it's the fucking character from one! He was kind of famous for a while. I used to get postcards from him all the time. Then one day, poof, he just vanished off the face of the earth. Talked to all his friends from back then, but nobody knows where he went. I guess he decided to keep heading north and hopped a ship. Couldn't any passenger record stating that far back, though. What are you working on now? Well, it's gonna sound crazy, we know we have a here saying here at SIT. Science that nobody understands is called magic, and science that only one person understands is called mad science. They're doing a little dabbling in the forbidden arts, eh? I know I checked the rule book thoroughly, and nothing specifically forbids what I'm doing. Haha, <laughs> I get you. So what's the plan? Oh well, I mean I've just met you. And I hesitate to get someone else mixed up in this. I'm pretty mixed up already. Last few days I've had to deal with fairies, time holes, shadow monsters, gross fishmen. You know about the fishmen? That's perfect. I can definitely use your help. Glad it wasn't the fairies you're interested in. I am curious, but some other time maybe. What I'm focused on now is predictive quantum telecommunications. I'm gonna just skip to the chase. Sure, folks, I'm trying to make a magical crystal to help me find my brother. How can I help? Well, okay, well, you all know the fishermen of this region come from a single source, the fish mother. Hmm. She's like a queen bee, you know? This one creature that laid all the fishman eggs, which is a little weird, actually, biologically speaking, because that indicates a dangerous lack of genetic diversity. See, honeybees avoid inbreeding through an extremely high rate of genetic recombination, but the fishmen don't have that advantage. So what? Ah, uh, never mind. Sorry. Get a little sidetracked there. The important thing is the fish mother is thought to have sort of a magical psychic link with all the fishmen. Well, legend has it the fish mother occasionally makes huge, beautiful pearls. How they make them is probably too gross to think about, but my working theory is if there's the right kind of fish mother DNA in it, I might be able to reconfigure it to make my own psychic link. Okay, so. Fish Mother's Lair is down the river, but the entrance is an organic valve. Oh, jeez, this is a huge butthole, isn't it? I was going to say cloaca, but yes. It's a huge butthole that keeps it out everything that's not related to it. Uh, you aren't going to like it. I already don't like it. I can make a sort of disguise goop to cover you with. Well, how much am I getting paid? I love treasure. I'm in. Great. I'm going to need to make the fishman disguise poop. I'm going to need some fishman eggs, about three pounds of them. Um, okay, so I need to open the manholes. Bugs. Collecting steam. Book. Oh, this book's way too advanced for me. Actually, there's one right up your alley, third shelf, third from the left. You have the order of bookshelf memorized? I don't have to memorize it. I understand the principles where I try and arrange things. Space-time rainbow. Oh my god. Three armor against every element? Check out my optics. Leave. Touch for something. 11 in 1 oil. Chunk of lead. Scrap metal. Touch for something useful. Gold plated cable and pocket battery. Ooh, moxie to pants? What's this? A dua? What's a dua container for fluids? What kind of fluids? Uh, okay. Back to grumpy man. Take it to the speakeasy. Believe creative arcane hot plates. Can I have one? What does it do? Cook from the comfort of my room. Fantastic. Into the robo fray. Oh my god. I'm going to die a horrible, horrible death. Um. Okay, I'm gonna clobber you. Hey ya! Please don't kill me before I get to my turn. Oh, he killed his own guy. That's nice. Three slayers damage to five enemies. Hey ya! Hey ya! Hey ya! Just don't hit the mushroom. Oh, wait, hold on. There's only five of them there. Hit the mushroom all you like, it will not matter. Keep splattering them, baby. Okay, so I'm gonna need to kill another one of these. Um. Do, do, do. Five sleaze. So you haven't attacked yet, so I'm gonna hit you with it. Okay, poison isn't something I'm really worried about. Uh, 18 damage. I'm going to kill you. Hey, up. Go, my rat. I want my rat to do something. Go, rat, you. Oh, my God. He fucking... He does AoE? Ah, da, 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 da. Get roboted, idiots. Robot fuel. Interesting. I'll get over it. Ask Rufus about the robot battle arena. 
As my robot ballerina, why do you have a robot ballerina? The fact that you even ask that question makes me think you never understand the answer. They're capable of self assembly replication, so it's hard to say. I see. Remember your metal detector? <gasps> oh my god! Metal detector. Key. Metal detector key. Key, 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 key. Hold on. I'm gonna forget unless I deal with this right now. What's in the laundry room? Wait, there's a rat. What's shaking? Want me to bring you some cheese? I'll see what I can do. Okay. It's a hole in the wall. Reach inside the hole in the wall. Yoink. Shadowy elixir. What does it do? My muscle and HP. Yeah, kind of shit house. Okay, fair enough. Barbecue wing maintenance. Oh, wait. Hot wire it. There's going to be barbecue sauce in here. Frigid ice cream scoop. Ooh, cold damage. Short stories of long winters. I choose not to be cold. It gives hot armor. Damn it. Sure. Keep reading. Not right now. Didn't I get another book? Reality shift. Only once per five, but it's still pretty good. I mean, that's a lot of armor of every element. What other books have we got? Wait, no, no. I should be... I should be finishing my level up. Like, what have we got? 130. We can take a muscle and a hot armor. Sure, give me this. I can also go down these sewers if I wish. Replace it. See what's behind the door. What's in here? Machine's broken. Uh, locker, SIT barometer. Plus three to magical weapon attacks. Not terrible. Door is painted shut. X rock mines. Oh yeah, right. It won't let me through this one. I've been to here before. Wait, it's looping. Combination lock. Okay. So I can't do anything else down here. It looks like. Steam powered radio. Can't access the greenhouse. Laundry room was kind of boring. Barbecue wing thing. Okay, let me out. So I don't know where to find the barbecue sauce. Wait, hold on. Was that... Barbecue sauce. Oh my god, I've done it. <laughs> hold on. Collect it. Oh, look, there's a shortcut to Rufus's lab. Sir. Barbecue sauce. Well, enjoy. 30 EXP, that's what I'm talking about, baby. Uh, I got 91. Never mind, I forgot I already spent it. Nine muscle. Can't get there quite yet. Or can I? One muscle, one muscle. That is a potion, which would give me one more. Nah, I can't get any more than that, though. Okay. Um, let's check out Ovid's shop. This one shouldn't take too long. Look, I got a present from my jelly bean up in the big house. The big house? What, like a mansion? Jail, you dope. She's been doing time upset because she went off to the tractor in the bank. Okay, her, her HP went up. Oh my god, what a store. Hey, bud. Hey there, fella, I'm interested in some quality merchandise. Let's see what he's selling. Oysters, gymnast shoes. Cannot imagine a less interesting book. Mechanical calculator. Um, cold armor to pants, SIT sports drink. Remove titanium staples. Okay, well, let's get rid of some of the garbage that we don't need. Um, those I'd like. Sell one of these. Sell a couple of these. Sell one of these. Um, that can go. Those can go. That can definitely stay. Um, 
Watch out for the dough, baby. I've got a bunch of these mushman spears, which I'm never gonna use. A couple of these mushroom caps. Um. See, I'm I kind of worry about getting rid of all of something. Spider fang, spider eggs, spider leg wand, goodbye. All these grease guns. Um, one welding mask, yeah, sure. Yeah, what have I got now? 522. I would like this. Read it. I'm not even interested in the poems of George Five's sort of like okay never mind what's with the beds how are you supposed to get rid of them and find us keepers can you teach me any hobo code oh sure do you know the one for free bed yet thanks okay so we're not gonna do this episode we're gonna do it next episode oh wait worms dig right we should be looking for these damn plump night crawlers to run you over this way no, we're good. Okay. Anyway, for now, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.